Folks, David Creative Craft House to show you one of our new puzzles I'm kind of excited about. It's unique to us. Uh, we call it Safe Cracker 40. Uh, you've got to find the combination essentially here to this uh, safe. Um, uh, 16 um, possible columns um, and you've got four levels high. Each must add to 40. Um, but it's even more complicated than it might first appear because you see these wheels here, the top three wheels are notched. Um, they essentially turn your 16 columns into 24 different possibilities. It really complicates the puzzle. Uh, all solid hardwood, uh, this model is alder, uh, really high quality. Um, these are laser engraved, not printed. This should last uh, a lifetime. Um, and I made this to be ergonomically very comfortable. It's about four and a quarter inches in diameter. You can see it nicely fits the palm. And I made the, uh, could have used one board on the bottom, but I used two because it allows you to turn all the wheels while you hold the base in your hand. Um, I think it's ergonomically really, really cool. And it is available in this, we'll call the standard model, which is quite nice. Uh, and there's a thicker wood too, uh, if, you, if you'd like that. Uh, this is also uh, really nice alder, uh, but the same deal. Um, it's based on a puzzle that I bought at auction on uh, English um, origin um, it, uh, from 1911. It was called the Great Burglar Puzzle. Um, and you can see it's made out of uh, paper. It's kind of like thin, thin cardboard, and the rings turn here. Never seen anything like it, never seen it documented. Didn't come with a solution, so I had to, I had to find it. Um, and it's a puzzle that you can really use some really good logical thinking to solve and, and you know, eliminate things, possibilities quite quickly. So I was able to solve it in, in a fairly efficient period of time. Um, but I enjoyed the process of, of going through that solution. Um, I, would, I would rate this as a level, level four, hard level four kind of puzzle. All right. I uh, hope you will enjoy, and this is uh, unique in the world. I've also laser engraved just kind of the instructions on the back here, so it's kind of a self-contained, nice little unit. Thank you.